All right, for today's video, I'm not exactly sure like what type of beat I want to make, but it's going to be something for like Nardo Wick, Future, Lil Baby. I don't know, but let's go. I'm in my Gloom Analog Lab Bank. This one's going to be perfect for like dark trap beats. Oh, yeah, Bell 5. Let's go with that. Maybe we could do like C sharp or even A sharp might be cool. Let's try A sharp. So maybe we'll just do like eighth notes as far as like the length goes. And to figure that out, like this is a bar of music right here, right? If we were to duplicate this over inside of here, that's four of them, right? And then eight. So this is gonna be eighth notes. Let's just figure out something that sounds cool. First one, that sounds good. I'm gonna run with that. Cause like I said, we are gonna run it through portal. So honestly, just trying to figure out like a cool little melody in the beginning is gonna be like the biggest part. And then we can add in some lower notes down here. Let's go a little bit longer on these. Skip a note right here, place here to build a chord. Maybe we'll take out the third and just keep the root in the fifth. And then let's shorten this. Let's go for like a pattern of like da da da. Or rhythm, my bad. Yeah, like that. Hold on. That's cool. I don't know what I'm doing. I could just take these over like this. And then we'll switch it right here. And then go up so we'll just sharpen the f to an f sharp and when you're moving in like semitones like that it really gives it um like a tension feel oh yeah that's hard effects on this we could take all of this and we can do the up five semitones so hold shift or down five so we could hold shift and go one two three four five and then you will see that it's still going to sound good these are going to fall out of the scale but it will still work right or we could go down by five one two three four five or you could just go up an octave or down an octave that kind of goes crazy but i did like up five two one two three four five maybe we will do something like this and then on this one switch it up i've never really done this before i'll be honest with you having like the last one be an octave but this one being only up by five and now what we could do is uh, add in some lower notes let's go super low and then we'll probably filter it out anyways but i like to have them in the background even when it's filtered out with eq because it just sounds really good <laughs> So we'll keep that the same. Then let's just all R to randomize a little bit. Also, I forgot to mention the new bank is done. I have a name for it. I have the artwork done. Remember, I did tell you that a part of the bank will be free and then the rest of the bank is going to have a whole bunch of presets that will be like the paid version. I just made a huge bank and decided I'm going to have a part of it for free. So all the sounds are crazy. So that's going to be cool. I'm really excited for that. So make sure to watch out for that. But till then, I'm going to get Keyscape. Keyscape just has pianos with really, really good low notes, especially in this cinematic one right here. Go 
Ooh. No processing yet either. string kind of goes crazy cut out lows and highs and then put a kickstart on it that's kind of fire let's widen that out Layer it in with the rest. I might just render this out and see what we could do as far as processing. And the first thing I'm going to do is add EQ, which we'll go to later. But I really want to add a uh, portal to this. So let's go output portal. Portal is just the, this, the one you need for these types of beats. Like there's just so much in it. There's so much you could do when you actually go into here. You got different types of modulations. You can add a whole bunch of different parameters that you can just like link, mess with. But to make this simple and to get ideas, I'm gonna just go through presets for right now. And then the thing you're gonna wanna do is bring down the dry and wet knob, usually around like 30 to 40% sounds really cool. So let's see what we can get going. See, like that already sounds good, right? Like you can get the vibe for it. Uh, you get the idea for it, but it's just too much. So that's when we bring it down. Hold on. I'm gonna try to mix two of them. I never done that. Let's just do that. Let's try, let's see if it works. It might get a little bit too crazy. And if you are interested in Portal, I do have an affiliate link. Shout out to Output in the description. So if you wanna check it out, you can hit that link. Let's see what we could do. Where was the other one I liked? one more portal why not the only other thing i want to try real quick is reversing this so let's actually make unique and the reason i'm doing that is so that it doesn't mess up the first one so all we got to do is alt y flip these render this out so it'll be up an octave then where is that normally and then reverse see what i'm saying and then it goes to the verse and we can like alternate those and obviously get these fade ins right but from here, we could get started with the drums. Nice low bounce with that. Leave a pause, then again. Just do that same bounce. And then just catch that little space right there where there's not too much going on. But you could also put one like here. Like this. Right. But I'm going to just like kind of have it like a floating type of snare. Double. 
Pan it. And then we'll leave this part kind of like that floating feel so that that snare that hits over here just like catches it back. All right, now we could do the 808. This is going to be the part where the soft clipper is just going to work perfectly and let this 808 just hit hard. I hate when that happens. I hate when I have it like recording, but then I have it down here so you don't get to see that moving, but I'm not going to redo that. That sounded cool. way too low i like this low part maybe like this we could work with that what if we dropped it down an octave so from here down 12 would be five negative five appreciate you watching drop a comment down below which tutorials you want to see next if you're interested in my gloom analog lab bank there'll be a link to that in the description make sure to join the discord as well link to that in the description other than that let's hear the full beat